Hey guys, this is the Microspore Inflatable Mushroom Fruiting Chamber. And this video is going to show you just a little bit more detail about what it is and what you'd be purchasing. So, uh, here it is. Uh, these are the holes on the sides. They come with these black plugs. Um, those are used to help seal up the container a little bit more to keep the CO2 high for your initial pin set. So in here, we, right now, we have a, I have a chestnut grow bag going and I just put an X slit in it. Um, and I, you can just set that bag right in there. You can actually fit two if you wanted. Um, this is about a, about a six inch block. Um, and yeah, you just set it in there, spray it around with some water, trying not to get it on, right in the crack of the, the slit you made. But um, yeah, you get the water in there and then you just take the flap, which just pulls over and secures with some Velcro. And then I just take the side flaps here and I just kind of pull them to get them um, to sit evenly on the sides uh, there. And if you want to do a full on seal, you can def you can certainly do that. The seal up here is just, just fine, but you can take some tape and tape there and tape a couple on the sides here if you want like a fully contained um, uh, setup for uh, whatever reason. But yeah, uh, the plastic plugs here, I switched them over to these sponge filters, which also are included. Uh, what they do is they just add for add to a little bit more airflow, a little bit more gas exchange um, for after the initial pin set. Because once you get that nice pin set, you want it to be able to grow out. You don't want to get, get suffocated out by the CO2. So um, once the pinning starts, I start to open this up once a day and I give it a little flap to do a full exchange of air. And then I switch to these sponge filters as well for the holes. Um, in terms of how often you have to spray it, it's not too often. Maybe maybe a light mist once a day is probably fine or once every other day. Um, it really doesn't need a whole lot. If you decide to go with a tub grow, um, it's, that's just fine too. There's a little drainage port there for cleaning. So if you make a mess in here, it's fine. Or you can put a little liner in there with a black trash, trash bag if you want. It's, it also has a black um, bottom to it. So to try and event, uh, prevent side pinning as well. And that comes up about two inches there. So, yeah. Uh, so that's the fruiting chamber. I uh, appreciate you guys watching. If you have any questions, feel, feel free to shoot them over, leave them in the comments. That helps algorithms and things like that. So I appreciate that. Uh, we're available at microspore.store. So that's M-Y-C-O-S-P-O-R-E dot S-T-O-R-E. Uh, so, um, yeah, kind of a weird URL, but I thought it was kind of neat too. So uh, we're also on Amazon. All right. Thanks, guys. I appreciate it. Let me know if you have any questions. Uh, much love. Take it easy. Bye.